Spot Modern Plays. Sonic, don't give me that shit. Sonic, don't sass me. We're playing Baby Sonic. <laughs> I'm gonna call him Baby Sonic for the rest of this. In uh, Chemical Plant Zone. Yeah. Chemical. Chemical Brand. Plant time. Oh, I hated this stage. The pink water? Yeah. We all did. And then with the... Dun 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 Yeah. This is, like, this is usually the stage where I stop, and most people stop playing Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, uh, even the blue, like, slides give me the... Uh, what was the thing you discovered recently that, like, blew your mind? Uh, so I was watching a, uh, something. It was, uh, called Sonic 2 What Happened by Chase Face Show. Okay. You should go check him out. He's a, he's a cool guy. He was, okay. he's going over all the Sonic games and seeing, like, how Sonic became not so good. Hey, Red Ring. Ooh. Cool. But, uh, he was talking about Sonic 2 and Chemical Plant Zone, and he pointed out that, whoops, oh. fucking spiny ass... Pointed out that these things, these paths, have all the blue Goo. gunk in them. Uh -huh. Ah, I missed it. That it jumps out of the uh, the pipes. Oh, and you didn't realize they weren't just colored blue. Yeah, there's like actual like a texture to it. Ah, uh, the pink water. It makes more sense in this game. I guess it didn't make sense back in the old ones. Yeah, see now it's clearly. Yeah. Oh, I remember oh, this. Oh, we're in the pink water. We're in pink water. Yeah, zone. we are. Yeah. This is exactly the part. Oh my god. And then, yeah, the momentum slows down, and this is why people are always like, Oh, Sonic's so fun when you're not moving fast. Uh, I'm gonna get that spring. Which I kind of agree with, in some ways. It depends. Uh. Also, yeah, jump, we, were, we, were, we were saying between episodes, this is, like, the funkiest... Chemical Plant Zone has some of the best Sonic music that music. ever has been. Yeah, and they remix all the stuff for this game. Yep. Get up the... There you go. <laughs> nice! That's something you can never do in the old ones. If, One you're, so if you're on a ramp, you uh, just can't. No, no. No, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I would say, yeah. Yeah, because you hold the X button to spin dash in this game. Oh, the platform. Moved. I see, I see. You can hold it, you can tap it, and tapping it will go faster. <laughs> Red ring. But, uh... Red ribbon army. Dude. It's, <laughs> it's my job to reference Dragon Ball. I've watched Dragon Ball since the last time we hung out. Yeah. In in some capacity. Dragon Ball or Dragon Ball Z? Or Super? Both. Which? All three. Yes. I watched <laughs> the first episode of all, th of all three. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, so I uh, I got a Xander keeps talking about Animu, and I was like, okay, let's. I joke about how I hate it, but like, let's give it a shot. Mm -hmm. And I watched some of the first episode of Dragon Ball. That is the '80s. Yep. That is hella the '80s. That style be old as tits. As, yeah. Uh, but there's a purity to the original Dragon Ball that I just love. Like, mm -hmm. It's just about a couple people who are just running around trying to like discover what the heck's going on with Goku. And then Z is like really, it's always at its best when it's fun, and it's at its worst when it's hyper serious, mm -hmm. is uh, generally how I feel about that. And the first episode of Z is also really weird because it's like, oh, the villain Vegeta, and you're like, guys, hurry up, we know where this goes. It's like the least. The first episode during Z is Raditz. Actually, you're right. Because Raditz yeah. was a whole thing before even. Even before even Raditz Vegeta. came, and then Goku died, and then it was a year before Vegeta and Nappa showed up. Yeah, you're right. And then Parallel 9000. And I remember when I was man. watching that, and Raditz had like the massive widow's peak. Yeah. Oh, you gotta listen to this yep. music. It's all funky and stuff. Yeah. Uh, so far, so far, whenever you gotcha. pick, whenever you pick the game, we get a game of funky music. Although Zelda has funky music too, but that's yeah. Nintendo. <laughs> oh, that's awesome! You do like a power slide. Yep. Ah, uh, I missed the red slide. Oh, so close. Uh, these are mar these are noticeably slower. I don't know. Ah, oh, you low pass. You fucking it up. I did. Oh, <laughs> they're like screw your pink water. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Jump right over. Amachash, shut up. I don't care about you. What was ah, the first game Amachash shut up in? Adventure two? Uh, maybe. I don't know or care. <laughs> it's either that or Sonic Heroes. Either way, he's oh not, god, you might be right. It's not good. Oh, ah. we don't talk about Sonic Heroes. I guess I did play that one. God, I really like mentally blocked out every Sonic game that I played. Uh, yeah, Sonic Heroes is bad. But it's like functional at least. Like yeah. I don't remember that game being buggy. I just remember it being like kind of weird. Oh, uh, where's the red star ring in here? And unfun. There's a ring in here somewhere. You're falling. You're gonna break. Skydiving. I'm gonna get hit. Skydiving. Oh, there it is. Oh, you definitely hit Got it like four times and you didn't get actually like hurt. Oh man, the game can't keep up. This wacky frame rate. All right, let's see if I can make this jump. Nice. I did it. It's been done. Those jumps always mess me up for some reason. But ah, uh, are your lives cross Sonic? It's not like you have. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I gotta go this way. 
Yeah, they made this is weird. I'm just trying to like take it all in right now. All the Sanic. All the Sanic. Original character did not steal. Uh huh. Uh huh. Gotcha. Uh, you uh. Up. Oh, I messed you up. You have original character do not steal actually. I do. Wait, is your is your animation based on a real character that already existed, or did you make that guy? I meant that guy. Yeah, original character, do not steal. Yeah. Xander, uh, I don't even need to tell people to watch that. That video has more views than anything we've ever made. <laughs> it does, and Combined. it's weird. Because, like, I'm just like, how even did that? It's just, like, your first significant piece of animation work, and it has, uh, now, I, well, last time I checked, like, 4,000-something views. It's weird. <laughs> and, like, a, and, like, good comments. Like, yeah. like, nice, like, not incredibly nice, but, like... Construct your comments. Yeah. There's like one or two that are just like, this sucks, you're bad. Yeah, yeah. But, but it's just like that. You're not going to avoid I that. I saw like the first time I got one of those, it's just like, well, I've made it on the internet. I've done something. Because you can't create anything without someone being like, you're stupid, you messed up. Like, yeah. That's never going to happen. I forgot to turn on the subtitles. Again, yes. Eh. We're going to miss all the story. <laughs> They're going to miss all the story. <laughs> it's... it's. This game has no story. Let's be real. This game's story is. Are they going to give me the origin of the pink water? It's, it's like, it's chemicals. You're it's a chemical plant. Is it a is it a nuclear plant that's making bombs for? The, is it a story about how Sonic was a human? <laughs> Who was if this that? was Sonic One, it would probably actually be making nuclear bombs because that was the plot of Sonic One. Eggman. Oh, was you're right. Nukes. You're totally right. That's the early nineties. Post Cold War fun times. And then once we got to Sonic Adventure, which was like, hey, giant monsters all the time. <laughs> giant water monsters. <clears throat> you ever think about how technically chaos the the villain. The enemy, the monster from uh, Sonic Adventure, uh, exists only because... Oh my god, Amy's free. Her voice is awful in this game. Is it really? Yeah. Let's hear a bit of it. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Just the one good thing I'll say about Sonic Boom is that her one noteness changed into a better one note. Oh, is it just different? It's just like... She saw, like, the... Uh, the Mm, like the mm, sort of girl uh, character sassy, in yeah. Sonic Boom, but then she's just like, "Hey, Sonic, I'm here to flirt with you," and that's about it. And it's just like, "Shut up!" I watched. Leave. I watched two seconds of the Sonic Boom cartoon. Don't let people tell you that that cartoon's uh, good. That hmm. I watched like 20 episodes of that cartoon with my friends at college, and I was just like, "Who's lying to themselves and saying it's good?" <laughs> my my friend was just like, "We need to watch more. It's so bad. We need to watch more." I was like, "Dude, I can't. We have to stop. I don't, I don't like suffering." He like he makes a point to watch bad stuff just so he knows. That it just like know everything like, no, why bad, bad about it, right? I'm just like, no, I need to stop. Like it was, the best parts about that was somehow Knuckles, even though they completely destroyed Knuckles in that. Well, because they make Knuckles like hilariously stupid, right? Plus Travis Willing, Travis Willingham, knows how to like, yeah. Okay. He was like Roy Mustang in uh, Watch McCall, Full Metal Alchemist as yeah. well. He does a lot of stuff, but like, somehow he made it so it didn't. Some lines didn't sound like it was just Knuckles being stupid. It sounded like Travis Willingham was like sh uh, taking the piss out of the. Uh, oh, I see. The voice directors, like there's one where Sonic's trying to ah, find oh, a new sidekick. Uh -huh. So Travis Knuckles comes in. And it's just like Travis S Knuckles. <laughs> I keep calling him Travis because yeah, yeah. actor voice actor's name. Yeah, but he comes in. And it's just like trying to ask Sonic to be his sidekick. Uh -huh. Like, Knuckles is completely serious, but Travis Willingham is like, yeah, you can be my sidekick. We'll have to change your name to something like uh, Knuckles Jr., though. <laughs> it's just like, Travis, please. Travis, please. Yeah, that, yeah, that show that is not, like, abysmal, but it's, It gets abysmal. Does it? Yeah. It starts out, like, not good and gets awful. Oh, I see. Uh, people... give, me the, give me the speed. I'm, I feel give like, it. oh, ah. this is weird. That's, like, trippy. Uh, people who are saying that cartoon is good are the people who, who are also saying Sonic Adventure is fun if you play it the right way. Which, mm. yeah, same people. Playing it the right way is playing There's no not half the game. There's no playing the right way or playing the wrong way. Exactly, exactly. It's playing half of it and then not touching anything resembling Bigs the Cat. That uh, moon in the background has an Eggman face. That's Death Egg. You're Death Egg. Is that the final level of the game or something? No. That was like the final levels of Sonic 2 and 3 and stuff. Oh, I see. Uh, yeah, that was the whole thing. Eggman made a space station moon, and then it crashed into Angel Island, and that's how they met Knuckles. Hurry. I was reading, uh, so, oh my, oh, that's really cool, how you don't have to actually touch the checkpoint. Yeah. That's, that's really smart of them. Invincibility. Invincibility. 
Uh, I was reading some like weird post that was like someone trying to. Someone was like, "Wait, how the hell does Sonic Adventures like mainland work?" Because if Mystic Ruins is supposed to be on the island of Angel, like I Angel Island, does that mean that Station Square is on Angel Island? I have no idea. Be and then if that, if if not, if someone's like, no, because Station Square is clearly supposed to be a New York or Philadelphia allegory, Oops. or you know, equivalent, not allegory, equivalent. Uh, how the hell does a train get from New York City to an island? Does Knuckles have like the building permits on Angel Island? Just is like, I guess you can make a train here. Yeah, he's God. Got no zoning. The, the zoning laws on Angel Island are fucked up. Yeah, that. I'm just gonna run through these. Really, answers. Don't think building. about it. Just yeah. Don't, don't even sort of think about it. So this uh, is this right. is. Uh, is this 2D Sonic? This, yes. This is uh, Sky Sanctuary from Sonic 3. Oh, lovely. Uh, every level in this game is from a previous Sonic game. Oh, remastered. so are we going to get into like modern Sonic levels? Yes. Like what? Uh, let me think. Uh, City, need to City Escape them. is coming up. Oh, really? Yep. Is the song? Yep. Oh, I'm so excited. Can we get to that today? Is that feasible? Uh, possibly. Oh my god. We'll have to see how fast I'm, a, I'm a third in. Oh, I'm So far, you're absolutely off. killing it. I don't want to, like, jinx anything. Oops. Well. <laughs> don't worry. I already fell. Already. You well, missed it. Next time Palmer plays. No, we're going to fit. We're at the end. We're at oh, the we're end at of the level. End? Okay. I really need to check don't in with you before I do me that. me now. I'm having a good time. I'm in a good ball. Don't yeah. stop me now. I fell. Yeah. Give me a call. I love that song. Sonic hat. Sonic there we go. There we go. I'm gonna hit those speed. Hat. What are those speed things? They are. They're like when you have those na like uh. They're like those things that you push like the toy cars yes. down, like the two wheels on the side. It's just like the yeah. Boom. Yes, and they are totally. I think they're just those. When modern Sonic, they're treadmills, sort of thing. with jigs. I was like. Pfft. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. I'm not as good at the classic stages. Oh so yeah. I'm gonna Young Sonic fall is cool. Okay. Well, next time, Palmer plays. We will play Modern Sky Sanctuary. <gasps> Get hype!